today's video, I wanted to share four different looks while incorporating four different handbags from my collection for each occasion. <laughs> Welcome or welcome back if you are new here. My name is May, also known as Miss Leva on YouTube, and today is a collab video. I'm so excited to be filming this video because a fellow YouTuber friend of mine and I are actually collaborating on this little video. Her name is Melissa, and we actually met through YouTube and in reality, I'm just so glad that I've been able to meet so many wonderful people through this platform. I started my Instagram page and then followed along with my YouTube channel because I wanted to share this passion of mine that I love, which is handbags and fashion. And it's so great to see that there are so many like-minded people out there that really enjoy this type of content as well. Now for the video idea, what we chose was we were basically going to put together four different looks, so four different outfits depending on certain categories. And the four categories that we chose are wedding, business casuals for those working women that still have to go into the office, we also wanted to do like a brunch day with the girls kind of look and then also a date night with your partner. I gotta say, I personally love putting looks together whenever I'm going anywhere, even if it's just to walk around Target. So when we talked about doing this video and she actually came up with this idea, I was super thrilled. I thought it would be really fun, especially since Melissa and I's style are very different. She has this girly edgy vibe to her which I love but I can't pull off and I feel like she does such a great job incorporating her stunning beautiful colorful handbag collection along with her style. So of course I'll have her Instagram handle and her YouTube channel linked down below. Once you finish watching my four outfits go ahead and head on over to her channel to check out her video and see the outfits that she put together. I myself cannot wait to watch it and I'm sure that she's gonna come up with super unique outfits outfits to go along with her handbag collection. All right, so without any more chit chatting, let's get right into this little lookbook. And I'm gonna start off with the wedding guest outfit. And I had so much fun putting this outfit together. This is actually an older dress that I have, so I'll try to link the same one. If not, I'll of course search for similar ones for you guys and link them down below. But I feel like this dress goes perfect for a spring summer wedding and that's kind of the seasons that we're heading into. So that's why I stuck with that theme. And then then to go along with the beautiful colors that the dress was showing off, I went ahead and opted for my Furla handbag. Now we did decide that we were going to incorporate any of our handbags from our collection, no matter if they were contemporary or if they were high end. And to me, weddings scream clutches. So that is the reason why I chose to go with the Furla Metropolis clutch. Now this one in particular, unfortunately, is no longer available. So I did hesitate on showing it to you guys, but I thought it paired perfectly with this outfit. However, I'll make sure to link similar clutch options down below for you. But overall, I really fell in love with this whole look. I felt like it was just so perfect for the spring and summer season. I personally wish I had more weddings to attend in order to buy more of these cute, flowy, girly dresses. So moving right along into the business casual category. Now, this one for me was super easy to choose from. I no longer work in an office setting, but I did work in an office setting for many many years so I loved dressing up and I loved going to work with like a nice blazer a nice pair of heels and obviously finishing the look with a gorgeous handbag so for this one what I did is I put together since it was more on the casual side a little shirt dress and this one is from H&M However, it has a nice length, so I feel like it's appropriate for an office setting. And then I went ahead and added a nice blazer on top and I cinched it in with a belt. By cinching it in, I feel like it just makes it a little bit more girly. And then for the shoes, I opted for these pointy heels. I feel like you can do no wrong with pointy heels for the office. So that's why I went ahead with this pair. I gotta say that for outfit number two, the handbag of choice was kind of difficult for me to pick. As I said, I have worked in office setting before. So I have a couple of large bags that I like to take into the office while I work there. So I couldn't just pick one, so I did pick two, and I wanted to show them to you here. The first one is the Celine luggage tote, and that is in the micro size. 
Guys, this bag holds so much. And for me, when I was going into the office, it was perfect because I could just throw everything inside. And there were times where I just had things in my hands that I didn't know what to do with them. And I would just throw it into the bag and then organize myself once I made it into the office. So this size in particular, I feel like it's great. I have a review on this bag, so I'll make sure to link it down below in case you want to check it out. And then the second option that I went for was my Pochette handbag. I'm not going to say the style name because I know I'm going to butcher it, so I'll make sure to link it somewhere on the screen. This handbag is so classy, you guys. It gives me total like Fendi peekaboo vibes, but the leather of this handbag is just so, so sturdy. It fits a ton as well. It has a crossbody strap, which is huge, especially when you're running into the office, either because you're late or because you have a meeting to attend to. So it's really nice to have that versatility in a handbag for the office. And as you can see in both options, I did go for a nude color. I just think that those beigey nude tones just match so well with everything. And since I did keep my outfit pretty neutral with darker colors, I thought that the pop of nude would just be so nice to add. Now, moving on to something a little bit funner, we did want to put together an outfit for brunch out with the girls. And I'm hoping that one day Mel and I will be able to meet and go out for brunch and put together a cute outfit and just, you know, have a chat, get to know each other a little bit more. So right into the look, I did go with a matching set. I feel like matching sets are so in at the moment and you can really do no wrong it's perfect because you have your top and your bottom settled you don't have to go crazy about trying to mix and match two pieces and then as you guys know I am obsessing over blazers lately so I thought that by adding a blazer over top you would just make the look a little bit classier Mel actually has the small Lulu which is absolutely stunning she has it in the beautiful blank vintage color from YSL and I feel like that's just such a perfect spring bag and then last but not least we have date night with your significant other and I love dressing up for date night I feel like that's one of the times when I have the most fun putting together outfits even though when I put together a specific outfit my husband looks at me and he's like where are you going I just feel like this is the perfect time for you to get dolled up. I mean, if we're going out with our significant other, I feel like we all want to look our best. So I had a really fun time putting this outfit together. Also, this is actually a new blouse that I recently added to my wardrobe and I love it. It's very Dior inspired in my opinion. I know I haven't been able to link it. I've spoken about it a couple of times on my Instagram also, but I did find it in H&M in the actual store online. It seems to be sold out. If it does come back in stock, of course, I'll link it below for you, but I'll definitely have similar options regardless noted down below. Now, I went with a pair of black skinny jeans and I really think it made the look somehow edgy but chic at the same time. So I definitely thought about Mel while putting this one together. And then for my shoe option, I did go with a strappy heel option. And then for the bag of choice, since it was date night, I opted for my beautiful Polen number one in the nano size for a little bit of a pop of color. You guys know how I feel about this handbag. I feel like you can incorporate it in every type of occasion. Occasion. I actually have a lookbook on this one also so I'll make sure to leave it linked down below for you but I just thought that since we actually kept the outfit pretty neutral and simple with the black jeans and the black shoes and a little bit of a pop on the top I thought that by adding the red handbag it totally completed the look all right guys so there we have it those were my four outfits that I chose for four different occasions while incorporating four different handbags or in this case I think I went with five different handbags from my collection i hope you enjoyed the video let me know which one was your favorite look once again i'm so glad i got together with mel in order to collaborate and make this video for you guys i feel like the fact that we both have kind of similar but different styles and totally different handbag collections once you head over to her channel you will totally see what i mean I thought that this video would be super fun and it would be helpful for a lot of different people with different styles just like us. I'll make sure to have Mel's information linked down below so go ahead and check her out and also check out her Instagram. She does a lot of like fashion inspiration as well and outfit of the day. So if you did enjoy the video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and if you are new here consider subscribing. Once again thank you so so much for taking some time out of your day to watch today and I hope to catch you in my next one. Bye everyone.